the power of emotional detachment. Steve was a man with strong emotional ties and lived everything with his heart. Since childhood, he was completely devoted in every relationship, but this intense devotion brought him great pain over time. Especially when her last relationship ended, she found herself in the deepest void of her life. It was at this point that he began to think about the power of emotional separation and how he could overcome that power. Chapter 1. Steve's Heartbreak Steve's streak of heartbreaks began during his high school years. Steve's world comes crashing down when his platonic crush Jessica starts dating one of the popular kids at school. She stayed in her room for days, staring at the walls and asking, Why me? she thought. This first experience showed how deep emotional wounds can be. After this incident, Steve began to experience uneasiness in his relationships. His breakup with his college girlfriend Emily was another turning point. Steve etched into his mental notebook every word Emily said in her breakup speech. It's not about you, it's about me. Steve had no idea what he really meant at that moment. Chapter 2. Steve's Enlightenment One day he went to the library to relax and distract his thoughts. While browsing through the shelves, he came across a book on Stoicism. The book was called Thoughts by Marcus Aurelius, one of the ancient Greek philosophers. Marcus Aurelius wrote that most people's suffering stems not from events, but from their reactions to them. Steve decided to delve deeper into this thought. This philosophical perspective, which is the basis of Stoicism, opened a new door in Steve's world. Maybe, thought Steve, I can control the power of these separations by how I respond to them. Chapter 3. Introducing the Principles of Stoicism Steve set out to research the basic principles of Stoicism and found some important points that he can apply to his own life. Things that can and cannot be controlled. Stoics argue that people can only control their own reactions and thoughts. Steve began to accept that his breakups were events beyond his control. Instead of focusing on the things he couldn't control, he tried to control his reactions. Management of emotions. Steve tried to learn not to be a slave to his emotions. He made Marcus Aurelius's mantra. It's not how the things that happen to you affect you, but how you react to them. Living in the moment. Stoics emphasize that we should not be caught up in the regrets of the past and the worries of the future. Steve decided to live each day in the best way possible. Instead of reliving the pain of her past relationships over and over again, she started thinking about happier moments in the future. Overcoming Emotional Addiction As Steve began to apply what he learned from his emotional separations, he realized that he also had to overcome emotional dependence. Emotional addiction is being extremely attached to someone else and focusing happiness entirely on that person. Steve began to look for ways to become an independent and strong individual. Definition of Emotional Dependence and Self-Knowledge and Acceptance Steve tried to define emotional addiction. She realized that in her past relationships she thought her partner's happiness was her own happiness. This created a huge void when the relationship ended. Steve understood that emotional dependence means that one depends on the existence of another for one's own emotional stability and happiness. To overcome emotional addiction, Steve decided to first know and accept himself. He started to focus on his own hobbies and interests. Steve discovered painting and hiking. These activities taught him new things about himself and showed him that he could be happy on his own. Building healthy relationships and self-mastery. Steve began to understand that a healthy relationship is about two independent individuals coming together. In their new relationship, they aim to establish a relationship that supports and adds value to each other rather than being dependent on their partner. In a relationship, both people should be happy as independent individuals, Steve thought. This thought helped her set healthier boundaries and be happier in her new relationships. Stoicism played an important role in helping Steve overcome both emotional separation and emotional dependence. This philosophical movement argues that people should not control external events, but rather their reactions to these events. By integrating Stoicism into his life, Steve became a more balanced and peaceful individual. Basic Principles of Stoicism Steve began learning the basic principles of Stoicism. Steve learned to control his emotions. Instead of immediately reacting emotionally to any event, he preferred to take a step back and evaluate the situation. Laws of Nature 
Stoics advocate compliance with the laws of nature. Steve accepted the challenges he faced in his life as part of a natural process. This perspective helped him experience less stress. Death and mortality. Stoics accept that death is inevitable and life is temporary. Steve embraced this thought and began to appreciate every moment. Steve integrated Stoic practices into his daily life. Negative visualization. By visualizing bad scenarios in advance, Steve learned to be more prepared when these situations occurred. This helped reduce her anxiety. Internal dialogue, Steve began having more positive and motivational conversations with himself. This challenge will make me stronger, he thought at every difficult moment. Own castle, guided by Marcus Aurelius's words, be safe in your own castle. Steve created a mental sanctuary. In stressful moments, he was able to retreat to this refuge and relax. Steve's new life. Steve made big changes in his life by embracing stoicism. He was now stronger against emotional separations and addictions. With the inner peace and balance that stoicism brought to him, Steve became a more resilient individual in the face of life's difficulties. Steve's Development Journey Part 1 – Investing in Yourself Steve's life was completely transformed by his journey of stoicism and personal development. Although it was difficult at first, over time he became a happier and more balanced individual thanks to the lessons he learned and the habits he acquired. In this episode, we'll dive deeper into the details of Steve's developmental journey. Steve realized that being emotionally stronger was also linked to physical and mental health. So he decided to invest in himself. He started doing sports and strengthened both his body and mind with regular exercises, Yoga and meditation have become an essential part of her daily routines. Yoga and meditation. Yoga. She started the day by doing yoga every morning. Yoga increased her physical flexibility and helped her relax mentally. Steve was able to control his stress and anxiety by learning breathing techniques while doing yoga. Meditation. Meditation became a turning point for Steve's mental health. By meditating for 15-20 minutes in the mornings and evenings, he was relieved of the stress of the day and began to live with a more focused mind. Meditation helped him find inner peace and focus on living in the moment. Healthy eating, balanced diet, Steve started to pay attention to his nutrition. Instead of fast food and processed foods, she preferred fresh fruits, vegetables and whole grains. This change increased his energy level and improved his overall health. Water consumption. He took care to drink enough water during the day. Water was important for the body to function properly, and Steve found that drinking water helped him feel more energetic and healthy. Sleep patterns. Regular sleep created a healthy sleep pattern. He made sure to go to bed and wake up at the same time every night. This made him more energetic and focused throughout the day. Adequate quality sleep contributed greatly to Steve's mental and physical health. Part 2. New Interests and Hobbies. In the process of getting to know himself, Steve discovered new interests and hobbies. While these hobbies added color to his life, they also increased his self-confidence. Painting artistic expression. Steve rediscovered the hobby of painting that had intrigued him since childhood. This became his way of expressing himself. While painting, he was clearing his mind and living completely in the moment. Art helped him put his inner feelings and thoughts on paper. Art courses. He attended art courses to improve his painting skills. These courses increased his technical knowledge and skills. At the same time, he expanded his social circle by meeting the art community. Nature walks. Connection with nature. He realized the peaceful effect of being in touch with nature. He started going on nature walks regularly on weekends. These walks helped him rest his mind and rejuvenate himself with the beauty of nature. Photography. He also discovered his hobby of photography during nature walks. By photographing the beauties of nature, he immortalized the moment and developed his artistic side. Volunteer work, contribution to society. Steve discovered the joy of being useful to society and helping others. By participating in volunteer work, he helped people in need and contributed to society. This made him feel better both emotionally and socially. Fundraising campaigns. Organized fundraising campaigns for different charities. These campaigns allowed him to improve his organizational skills and help more people. Chapter 3. The Art of Building Healthy Relationships Steve began to apply what he had learned about building healthy relationships. In his new relationships, he adopted an approach based on mutual respect and independence. Instead of addiction and excessive commitment in relationships, 
he took care to establish a more balanced and healthy communication. Emotional connection. Steve understood that empathy and understanding are the cornerstones of a relationship. By trying to understand his partner's feelings and needs, he established a deeper and more meaningful bond. Empathy allowed him to be more understanding and supportive in relationships. Listening skills. Developed active listening skills. He tried to understand his partner better by really listening to what he was saying. This contributed to the relationship becoming healthier and stronger. Setting boundaries. Personal space. Realized the importance of both parties having their own boundaries as independent individuals. These boundaries contributed to the relationship being healthier and more balanced. By protecting his own personal space, Steve gave his partner the same right. Independence. By maintaining her own independence, she avoided dependence on her partner. This made the relationship more balanced and egalitarian. Open communication. Honesty. Steve learned that open and honest communication is important in resolving problems and maintaining a healthy relationship. He talked openly with his partner about everything and tried to solve the problems before they escalated. Communication skills. By improving his communication skills, he learned to speak more effectively and constructively. This helped build the relationship on stronger foundations. Steve's New Life Philosophy Part 1 Daily Routines and Habits By integrating all these lessons he learned into his life, Steve became a happier and more balanced individual. He no longer allowed emotional separations and addictions to control him. He learned to cope with the challenges that life brings while maintaining his own happiness and inner peace. Steve adjusted his daily routines and habits based on the lessons he learned. These routines helped him maintain both his physical and mental health. Morning routines, yoga and meditation. She started the day early and practiced yoga and meditation. These practices helped her reduce her stress level and start the day with a calmer mind. Healthy breakfast. He consumed healthy foods for breakfast and focused on his goals by planning the day. Evening routines, making time for himself. He took time for himself in the evenings and took care of his hobbies. He read books, painted or went on nature walks. Gratitude. Before going to bed, she reflected on the day and wrote down the things she was grateful for. This enabled him to sleep with a positive mind. Part 2. Making time for yourself. Steve realized the importance of taking time for himself. By striking a balance between work, social life and personal time, he took care not to neglect himself. Self-improvement, new skills. By investing in himself, he continued to learn new things. He attended online courses, read personal development books and learned new skills. Knowing himself. He tried to know and understand himself better by continuing his inner journey. This enabled him to become a stronger and more emotionally aware individual. Social links, family and friends. He also cared about his relationships with his family and friends and spent quality time with them. Having strong social ties helped him become emotionally stronger. Social activities. By participating in social activities, he strengthened his relationships with the people around him and made new friendships. Chapter 3. Enjoying Life. Steve learned to enjoy life. He appreciated every moment and realized the little pleasures of life. Living the moment, mindfulness. He learned to enjoy the moment without being caught up in the regrets of the past and the worries of the future. With mindfulness techniques, he began to live every day to the fullest. Daily happiness. He enjoyed life by creating small moments of happiness in his daily life. A cup of coffee, a good book or a pleasant conversation increased his happiness, humor and joy, the power of laughter. Steve discovered the importance of adding humor and joy to his life. By laughing at the little things, he was able to overcome life's difficulties more easily. Funny memories. He collected funny memories and did not forget to laugh at every opportunity. She noticed that laughter had positive effects on her overall health and happiness. New Era in Steve's Life Part 1 Change in His Career as Steve made great strides in his journey of stoicism and personal development, new periods and opportunities began to emerge in his life. As her confidence grew, she found the courage to make significant changes in her career and personal life. Steve also began looking for a more emotionally fulfilling path in his career. He aimed for a more meaningful and satisfying career by getting away from the stress and pressure at work. 
He took several important steps in this process. Career counseling, self-discovery. Steve tried to get to know his own talents and interests better by getting help from career counselors. These consultancies helped him discover in which areas he could be more successful and happy. New goals. During the counseling process, she determined her long-term career goals. These goals contributed to his more motivated and focused work. Training and certifications, new skills. Steve decided to acquire new skills to advance his career. He updated his knowledge and skills by participating in online courses and certificate programs. Leadership training. By receiving training, especially in the field of leadership and management, he was able to take a more active role in the workplace. These trainings improved his communication and problem-solving skills. A new job. Job change. When Steve was not satisfied with his current job, he started looking for a more suitable job. After several months of intense searching, he found a new position where he could both use his skills and be emotionally satisfied. Passionate projects. In his new job, he started to do more meaningful work by taking part in projects that benefit society. These projects enabled him to experience emotional satisfaction in his business life. Part 2. What's new in personal life? Steve also experienced new milestones in his personal life. During this process, he made changes that positively affected not only himself, but also the people around him. Healthy lifestyle, exercise and nutrition. Steve continued to maintain his healthy lifestyle. He started going to the gym regularly and further improved his eating habits. These changes increased his physical health and energy. Routine health checks. He started paying more attention to his health and going for regular health checks. This helped him detect health problems early and take precautions. Social environment, new friendships. Steve attended various events to expand his social circle. By making new friendships, he made his social life more colorful and rich, strengthening old ties. He also strengthened his relationships with old friends and family. He spent more time with his loved ones by organizing frequent get-togethers and events. Self-improvement, goal-setting. Steve continued to set new goals for himself on his personal development journey. At the end of each month, he reviewed his goals, evaluated his progress, and developed new strategies if necessary, keeping a diary. He kept a diary and wrote down his thoughts and feelings. This helped him understand himself better and take more conscious steps on his inner journey. Part 3. Contribution to Society Steve realized how important it was for him to contribute to society. In this regard, he devoted more time to volunteer work and took an active role in various social responsibility projects. Volunteer work, working with children. He guided children by doing voluntary work on their education and development. This contributed to him both experiencing emotional satisfaction and being useful to society. Environmental protection. He worked to protect nature by taking an active role in environmental protection projects. He participated in tree planting events and led recycling campaigns, donation and aid, charities. He helped people in need by donating to different charities. These donations satisfied his desire to contribute to society. Community centers. By organizing various events in local community centers, it brought people together and contributed to the strengthening of social ties. Lessons learned from Steve's journey, part one, self-management. Steve's story shows that emotional and personal growth is a continuous journey. In this journey, knowing ourselves, acquiring healthy habits and contributing to society are among the important steps. With the lessons he learned and the habits he acquired, Steve positively impacted not only his own life but also the lives of those around him. Steve learned the importance of knowing and managing himself. During this process, he was able to maintain his emotional and mental health and lead a happier and more balanced life. Self-awareness, recognition of emotions. By recognizing and accepting his emotions, Steve learned to deal with them in a healthier way. This increased his emotional resilience, thought control. He protected his mental health by adopting positive and constructive thoughts instead of negative thoughts. Thought control helped him live a happier and more peaceful life. Part 2. Health in Relationships Steve learned to set healthy boundaries and act with empathy in his relationships. This helped him form deeper and more meaningful relationships. Healthy Boundaries Personal Space He created healthy boundaries in his relationships by protecting his own personal space and granting the same right to his partner. This made relationships more balanced and stronger. 
Independence. By learning to act as independent and strong individuals in their relationships, they established a healthier bond with their partner. Empathy and understanding. Emotional connection. By acting with empathy and understanding, she better understood her partner's emotional needs and expectations. This contributed to their relationship becoming deeper and more meaningful. Active listening. With active listening skills, he communicated more effectively and constructively with his partner. This allowed problems to be resolved more quickly and effectively. Chapter 3. The Importance of Contributing to Society Steve understood how important it was to contribute to society, both personally and socially. In this regard, he devoted more time to volunteer work and social responsibility projects. Volunteer work. Working for the society, participating in voluntary work and taking an active role in projects addressing the needs of the society. This contributed to him experiencing emotional satisfaction and being useful to society. Environmental protection. He worked to protect nature by taking an active role in environmental protection projects. This enabled him to contribute to both nature and the future. Takeaways from Steve's story. Steve's story shows that the journey of personal growth and emotional strength is a lifelong process. Knowing yourself, establishing healthy relationships and contributing to society are among the most important steps in this journey. By taking these steps, Steve positively impacted his own life and the lives of those around him. The lessons from Steve's story are not just about emotional strength, but also about personal growth and inner peace. In our own inner journey, we can live a happier and more balanced life by taking the right steps and adopting the right habits, just like Steve. Steve continues to inspire us as a hero who has discovered the secret of true happiness by preserving his inner strength and peace, despite the ups and downs of life. New Adventures in Steve's Life, Part 1, Travel and Discoveries Steve's personal growth journey has opened new doors and led to experiences he could never have imagined before. After finding balance in her life, it was now time to embrace adventure and excitement. This new period gave him a broader perspective and added more color to his life. Steve realized how exploring new places and meeting different cultures would enrich him. So he started making plans to travel and see the world, to explore new places, going on a European tour. Steve visited various countries in Europe, exploring different cultures and lifestyles. Historical buildings in Italy, vineyards in France, and lively festivals in Spain brought new perspectives to Steve's life. Asian Adventure Embarked on a journey to experience the mystical and rich cultures of Asia. Zen gardens and temples in Japan, yoga and meditation centers in India, exotic foods and beaches in Thailand nourished his soul. Solo travel, journey of self-awareness. Steve had the opportunity to be alone with himself by traveling solo. These journeys helped him explore his inner world more deeply and strengthen his sense of independence. Being in touch with nature. He enjoyed the natural beauties by camping and trekking in nature. Being alone allowed him to find inner peace and create a strong connection with nature. Part 2. Artistic Creativity Steve's passion for painting led him to further explore and develop his artistic side. Art became an area where he found emotional expression and reflected his inner world. Art exhibitions opening his own exhibition, Steve made an agreement with an art gallery to exhibit his paintings. He attracted great attention in his first exhibition and met many art lovers. This further strengthened his artistic identity. Art activities. By participating in various art events, he collaborated with other artists and learned new techniques. These activities broadened his artistic perspective and increased his creativity. Art courses and workshops teaching. Steve started teaching art classes to share his talents in painting. These courses allowed him to pass on his knowledge and experiences to others. Workshops. He worked with people interested in art by organizing art workshops. These workshops expanded her social circle and helped her establish new friendships. Chapter 3. Writing and Narration A new passion emerged in Steve's life. Writing. Putting his experiences, learnings and imagination into writing became a new form of expression for him. Writing a book. First book. Steve began writing a book about his personal development journey. In this book, he shared his experiences and the lessons he learned. His book has inspired many people and served as a guide to emotional strength. Different genres. 
He wrote not only in personal development, but also in fiction and essay genres. Using his imagination, he took his readers to different worlds and touched their hearts. Blog and articles, online platforms. Steve began to reach a wide audience by blogging. He shared his experiences and thoughts by writing articles on his own website and various online platforms. Guest writer. He wrote articles as a guest writer in different magazines and websites. This consolidated his writing career and allowed him to reach a wider readership. Chapter 4. Education and Training. Steve also began taking steps in the field of education to teach and inspire others what he learned. Education became a way for him to contribute to society by sharing his knowledge. Personal Development Seminars, Motivational Speeches Steve began giving motivational speeches at various institutions and organizations. In these speeches, he inspired people by sharing his own experiences and learnings. Workshops He organized workshops on personal development and emotional strength and taught practical information and techniques to the participants. Mentoring and Coaching Individual Coaching Steve guided people on their personal development journey through individual coaching. This enabled him to provide more in-depth support in one-on-one -on -one relationships. Mentoring programs. Mentored young professionals and students, helping them advance in their careers and personal development. Takeaways from Steve's story. Steve's story shows that the journey of personal growth and emotional strength is a lifelong process. Knowing yourself, establishing healthy relationships, contributing to society and being open to new adventures that life offers are among the most important steps of this journey. By taking these steps, Steve positively impacted his own life and the lives of those around him. Steve learned the importance of knowing and managing himself. During this process, he was able to maintain his emotional and mental health and lead a happier and more balanced life. Self-awareness, recognition of emotions, by recognizing and accepting his emotions, Steve learned to deal with them in a healthier way. This increased his emotional resilience. Thought control. He protected his mental health by adopting positive and constructive thoughts instead of negative thoughts. Thought control helped him live a happier and more peaceful life. Health in relationships. Steve learned to set healthy boundaries and act with empathy in his relationships. This helped him form deeper and more meaningful relationships. Healthy Boundaries, Personal Space He created healthy boundaries in his relationships by protecting his own personal space and granting the same right to his partner. This made relationships more balanced and stronger. Independence By learning to act as independent and strong individuals in their relationships, they established a healthier bond with their partner. Empathy and Understanding Emotional Connection by acting with empathy and understanding, she better understood her partner's emotional needs and expectations. This contributed to their relationship becoming deeper and more meaningful. Active listening. With active listening skills, he communicated more effectively and constructively with his partner. This allowed problems to be resolved more quickly and effectively. The importance of contributing to society. Steve understood how important it was to contribute to society, both personally and socially. In this regard, he devoted more time to volunteer work and social responsibility projects. Volunteer work, working for the society, participating in voluntary work and taking an active role in projects addressing the needs of the society. This contributed to him experiencing emotional satisfaction and being useful to society. Environmental protection. He worked to protect nature by taking an active role in environmental protection projects. This enabled him to contribute to both nature and the future. Steve's story shows that the journey of personal growth and emotional strength is a lifelong process. Knowing yourself, establishing healthy relationships, contributing to society and being open to new adventures that life offers are among the most important steps of this journey. By taking these steps, Steve positively impacted his own life and the lives of those around him. The lessons from Steve's story are not just about emotional strength, but also about personal growth and inner peace. In our own inner journey, we can live a happier and more balanced life by taking the right steps and adopting the right habits just like Steve. Steve continues to inspire us as a hero who has discovered the secret of true happiness by preserving his inner strength and peace despite the ups and downs of life. Steve's New Life Philosophy Part 1 Self-Compassion and Self-Love 
While Steve took important steps in his personal development journey, he developed a new philosophy of life over time. This philosophy helped him live a happier, more balanced and meaningful life. These principles, which he applied in every aspect of life, made him an inspiring figure not only individually but also to those around him. Steve understood the importance of self-compassion and cultivating self-love. She realized that being at peace with herself was essential to her emotional and mental health. Self-compassion, accepting imperfections. Steve admitted that he doesn't have to be perfect. By accepting her flaws and weaknesses, she learned to treat herself more compassionately. Learning from mistakes. He saw the mistakes he made in the past as learning opportunities. These mistakes contributed to his growth and maturation. Self-love, positive internal dialogue, used positive and supportive language when talking to himself. This increased his self-confidence and self-esteem. Understanding one's self-worth. Instead of basing one's worth on external approval, one developed an internal sense of value. This allowed him to become a more independent and strong individual. Part 2. Living in the moment and mindfulness. Steve learned to live in the moment without being caught up in the regrets of the past and the worries of the future. Mindfulness techniques helped her maintain her mental and emotional health. Living the moment, daily practices. He practiced mindfulness for a few minutes every day. These exercises helped her stay in the moment and maintain mental clarity. Awareness of simple pleasures, enjoyed the small pleasures of daily life. A cup of coffee, a beautiful view or a pleasant conversation became sources of happiness for him. Mindfulness, meditation. By meditating regularly, he calmed his mind and got rid of stress. Meditation helped him find inner peace and maintain emotional balance. Awareness walks. By taking awareness walks in nature, he felt the beauty and calm of nature more deeply. These walks strengthened his mental and emotional health. Chapter 3. Social Ties and Community Contribution Steve understood the importance of strong social ties and contributing to society. He deepened his relationships with people and took part in projects beneficial to society. Strong social ties, family and friends, strengthened relationships with family and friends. By spending more time with them, these relationships became deeper and more meaningful. Social activities. By participating in different social events, he met new people and expanded his social circle. This enriched her social life and strengthened her emotional support system. Contribution to society volunteer work. Participated in volunteer work that would benefit the society. These studies allowed him to experience emotional satisfaction and contribute to society. Social responsibility projects. He took an active role in various social responsibility projects. These projects increased his contribution to society and reinforced his awareness of social responsibility. Chapter 4. Continuous Learning and Personal Development Steve embraced the importance of lifelong learning and personal development. During this process, he constantly tried to improve himself and gain new knowledge. Education and learning, courses and seminars. He updated his knowledge and skills by attending various courses and seminars. This contributed to his development personally and professionally. Reading books. By reading books regularly, he gained knowledge on different subjects and increased his intellectual knowledge, new experiences, hobbies and interests. He added color to his life by discovering new hobbies and interests. This increased his creativity and motivation, travel and discovery, travel to explore different places and cultures. These travels broadened his worldview and allowed him to gain new experiences. Lessons from Steve's journey. Steve's story shows that the journey of personal growth and emotional strength is a continuous process. In this journey, important steps include knowing yourself, establishing healthy relationships, contributing to society and lifelong learning. By taking these steps, Steve positively impacted his own life and the lives of those around him. Self-awareness and self-love. By acting with self-awareness and self-love, Steve maintained his emotional and mental health. This helped him live a happier and more balanced life. Healthy relationships. By setting healthy boundaries and acting with empathy, Steve built deeper, more meaningful relationships. This enriched her social life and strengthened her emotional support system. Social contribution. By contributing to society, Steve experienced emotional satisfaction and benefited society. Volunteer work and social responsibility projects strengthened his social awareness. Continuous learning. 
Steve embraced the importance of lifelong learning and personal development. He constantly improved himself with new experiences and knowledge. Steve's Legendary Story, Part 1, An Inspiring Leader Steve's life has become a legend that has not only shaped his own development but also inspired others and left a lasting impact on society. Steve discovered the power of positively changing the lives of people around him through the steps he took towards personal and social development. Steve continued to inspire those around him by developing and applying his leadership skills. His leadership showed its impact not only in the business world but also in social projects. Leadership Philosophy, Empathic Leadership Steve adopted a leadership style based on empathy. By understanding the emotional needs of its employees and colleagues, it increased their motivation and job satisfaction. Participatory Management By involving team members in decision-making processes, everyone's opinions and ideas were taken into account. This enabled his team to be more engaged and collaborative. Social Leadership Working for the Society he continued to serve the society by leading volunteer work. In these projects, he collaborated with local communities and developed solutions for their needs. Global Initiatives He took an active role in international projects and worked to find solutions to global problems. These initiatives earned him recognition as a global leader. Part 2 Effective Communication and Media By improving his communication skills, Steve was able to deliver his messages to larger audiences. Media and digital platforms played an important role in sharing his story and teachings. Media usage, social media impact. He created a large follower base by actively sharing on social media platforms. Through these platforms, he provided information and inspiration on personal development and leadership. Podcast and video content. By producing podcast and video content, it managed to reach different audiences. These contents conveyed his thoughts and experiences to a wider audience. Effective speeches, conferences and seminars. He regularly spoke at conferences and seminars, inspiring his audiences. At these events, he shared valuable information on personal development and leadership. Publications and articles. He reached a wide readership by writing articles in different magazines and online platforms. These articles were effective in sharing his knowledge and experiences. Part 3. Innovative Projects and Initiatives. Steve continued to add dynamism to his life with innovative projects and initiatives. These projects developed his creative thinking and problem-solving abilities. Innovative initiatives, social innovation, developed projects to find innovative solutions to social problems. These projects aim to improve people's quality of life by addressing social problems. Technological innovations, it offered solutions to social problems by developing projects in the field of technology and innovation. These projects developed his technological abilities and innovative thinking skills, training and development online education platforms. By establishing online education platforms, it managed to reach large audiences. On these platforms, he provided training on personal development and leadership. Workshops and workshops. By organizing workshops and workshops, it helped participants improve their knowledge and skills. These activities increased his influence in the field of education. Chapter 4. Future Visions. Steve had big visions of the future. These visions became important goals that shaped his life and career. Future Plans – Global Education Networks By creating global education networks, it aimed to provide education and development opportunities to people from different countries. These networks increased its global influence. Sustainable Development By developing sustainable development projects, it aimed to leave a more livable world to future generations. These projects reflected his environmental awareness and commitment to sustainability. Long-term goals, establishing his own foundation. He planned to establish a foundation bearing his name and carry out projects in the fields of personal development, leadership and sustainability. This foundation would be a structure that would carry his legacy and influence into the future. Organizing global events. By organizing global events and conferences, it aimed to inspire people around the world and contribute to their development. Steve's lasting impact and role as an inspiration. Steve's story shows that personal growth and emotional strength are a lifelong journey. This journey can have a huge impact not only individually but also socially. Steve continues to inspire those around him with the steps he takes towards knowing himself, establishing healthy relationships, contributing to society and constantly learning. 
self-awareness and self-love. By acting with self-awareness and self-love, Steve maintained his emotional and mental health. This helped him live a happier and more balanced life. Healthy relationships. By setting healthy boundaries and acting with empathy, Steve built deeper, more meaningful relationships. This enriched her social life and strengthened her emotional support system. Social contribution. By contributing to society, Steve experienced emotional satisfaction and benefited society. Volunteer work and social responsibility projects strengthened his social awareness. Continuous learning. Steve embraced the importance of lifelong learning and personal development. He constantly improved himself with new experiences and knowledge. Inspiration from Steve's story. Steve's story inspires us all to live a happier, more balanced and meaningful life. Lessons to be learned from his journey focus on knowing ourselves, building healthy relationships, contributing to society and constantly learning. Steve continues to inspire us as a hero who has discovered the secret of true happiness by preserving his inner strength and peace despite the ups and downs of life. His story can help us make positive changes in our lives and live a more meaningful life.